Queen's Gambit declined, Catalan opening. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed Black in that one. White took advantage of the opportunities they saw in the opening. White pounced on their opportunities in the middle game. Opening with the Queen's Pawn. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. Nf3 strengthens the d4 piece and moves the knight closer to the center while exerting more control over the e5 square. The center's d5 square expands and obtains control of the e4 and c4 squares. The d5 pawn is protected by e6 while the dark squared bishop can advance. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. This prevents a rival bishop's check. That was a free pawn. By positioning the bishop on a potent diagonal, this fianchettos the bishop. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. It is the last book move. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This might indicate that a rook was attacked. It is ideal. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a rook. It is a great move. That's a decent move. That's good. This turns the pawn into a passed pawn, which means no other pawn may oppose it as it advances. It is ideal. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. By doing this, a queen moves off of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. That pawn was available for free. It is ideal. Thus, a pawn is lost. It is incorrect. This is how you take the pawn. It is ideal. This poses a queen winning danger. It is incorrect. This seizes a helpless pawn. It is ideal. Backs off. It is quite good. This misses a chance to win back a piece. It is incorrect. This wastes a chance to gain a pawn. That falls flat. Recaptures, from a previous move. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This enables the adversary to disclose an attack on a knight. It is incorrect. This exposes an attack, threatening a knight. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. This threatens to win material. It is best. As a result, the adversary can pin a knight. It is incorrect. This buys time by putting a knight in danger and getting it to flee. It is quite good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This misses an opportunity to win a knight. It is a miss. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. This pins a bishop and increases pressure. It is ideal. As a result, the rooks are placed in a single file and are able to cooperate to pose a danger. It is quite good. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. Thus, the attacked pawn is protected. That is good. The rooks are coordinated and powerfully doubled on the file. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. White took advantage of the opportunities they saw in the opening. White pounced on their opportunities in the middle game. 